It's your birthday. Welcome to Vegas. We're at... We're at... Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, our mission for today is we're going to attend the Rice Festival in Mojave Desert. So this is day two of the Rice Festival. So day one, they pretty much just left all night. Yeah. <laughs> yes, we did slept because we worked the night before our flight so now we're pumped up we had eight hours of sleep or more than eight hours of sleep right okay mark so we're going to the rice festival yeah so this year would be the sixth year that um, they're doing the festival it's a three-day event um, it ha you get two chances to fly um, two lanterns per person and then afterwards there's also fireworks um, this festival, there's several bands that would be playing, and um, I guess it's all about writing something, and it's special for each person because they would, when you release the lantern, you would be releasing something also, a part of you, or like letting go of worries, something like that. It's something that I've always wanted to do a few years back, and finally we're doing it this year. Yes! Candidate number one! <laughs> Every October, the Rice Festival is held in the Mojave Desert outside of Las Vegas. Tens of thousands of people gather together to simultaneously launch biodegradable lanterns into the night desert sky. Each lantern means something unique to every individual, but together, they give a collective voice to our hopes and dreams in one beautiful display. Personally, with this lantern, I am letting go of what is gone, appreciate what still remains, and look forward to what is coming next. Swiss artist Hugo Rondinoni's colorful large-scale artwork Seven Magic Mountains is a two-year exhibition located in the desert outside of Las Vegas, Nevada. Featuring seven 30 to 35 foot high day glow totems comprised of painted locally sourced boulders. According to the artist, the location is physically and symbolically midway between the natural and the artificial. The natural is expressed by the mountain ranges and the desert, while the artificial is expressed by the highway and constant flow of traffic between Los Angeles and Las Vegas. Our next destination. Albuquerque. Each fall, many will come from all over the world to the Albuquerque International Balloon Festival, the world's largest hot air ballooning event. For nine days during the first week of October, hundreds of colorful balloons float above the city each morning as dawn breaks over the Sandia Mountains. The visual feast is noted to be the most photographed event. In my opinion, indeed, it is one for the books. Although we were not able to ride into the balloons, as it cost already $500, we still had a lot of fun watching the balloonists prepare their balloons. It was an amazing experience. Nearly 750,000 visitors attend the Hot Air Balloon Festival each year, so make plans early to join the fun. Don't miss the chance to experience this one-of-a-kind Hot Air Balloon Festival.
was your balloon experience? It was awesome. This is amazing. It's another feel. It's a different feel. Every second week of October, there's an international balloon festival. Hi guys! <laughs> so, we had a power nap for about two hours and we are here in Santa Fe, New Mexico. So Santa Fe is the capital of New Mexico. Lay right? Is that right, Lay? Okay. Yeah, the, uh, the capital of New Mexico, Santa Fe. <laughs> <laughs> the Loreto Chapel is a former Catholic church that is now used as a museum and a wedding chapel. It is known for its unusual helix-shaped spiral staircase, the Miraculous Stair. The Sisters of Loreto credited St. Joseph with its construction. Welcome to Sandia Peak! We are currently um, catching the sunset at the Sandia Peak. The Sandia Mountains are the big landscape feature in Albuquerque. And every day, when the sun sets, the mountains turn a lovely shade of pink for a short while. At Sandia Peak, a 45 minutes drive, central Albuquerque offers not just stunning views, but you can also participate in other outdoor activities depending on the time of the year. So if you happen to visit Albuquerque, don't forget to check out this place. Also, if you plan to visit the featured places mentioned earlier, might as well include Las Vegas, a resort city famed for its vibrant nightlife centered around casinos and other entertainment options. Embarking on a journey with friends is an unpredictable voyage that every person should experience at least once in their life. Exploring different countries and discovering new perspectives together ultimately progresses our relationships to levels never imagined possible. Even when we return from the trip with friends, we will always keep those golden memories for the rest of our lives. Mm -hmm.